Pirates traded longtime face of the franchise Andrew McCutcheon to the Giants on Monday, and they received two prospects in return, outfielder Brian Reynolds and right-hander Kyle Crick. Reynolds was a second-rounder in the 2016 draft, had a chance to go in the first round, flash that ability while he was at Vanderbilt, has a chance to have pretty solid tools across the board with the possible exception of his arm strength. He's a switch hitter. That looks good from both sides of the plate. Has some power, above average runner. Has a chance to stay in center field. If, if he can, he may fit more in left because the arm is below average. But he's a guy, to me, who projects as an everyday player at the big league level. And I thought he was a bit of a steal in the second round. Crick was a first round pick, or supplemental first round pick, way back in 2011. Has long, for a long time had one of the biggest arms in the Giants system. He's got a fastball that can go up to 100 miles an hour. He's got a two seamer with less velocity and heavy sink. He's got a hard slider that could be in the mid 80s, but he's really battled his control during his Giants career. Bounced back and forth between the rotation and the bullpen, finally found a home in the bullpen in 2017, made his big league debut, had some success in San Francisco. If he doesn't throw more strikes, I think his ceiling is probably that of a seventh inning reliever, but it's a big-time arm. All in all, I think not a bad return for Andrew McCutcheon, who's going to be a free agent in another year and probably was not going to get a qualifying offer from the Pirates. So I like getting Reynolds and Crick rather than letting him walk at the end of the season.